I made hot cocoa. We're gonna wrap gifts together. Like, so I hope you're ready for that. channel today we are going Christmas shopping so y'all better buckle up because it's about to be super Christmassy right now huh so I have literally bought two gifts <gasps> I need to buy more stuff if you guys have been watching my um, all of my videos and everything like that and been keeping up with like my social media and all that kind of stuff then you know that I recently moved in with my brother and my sister-in-law his wife so I'm getting presents for them and then I also have to buy a present for my sister because we do like a um, like a draw of a hat kind of a thing for our Christmas presents so each sibling only gets one gift today's the 21st so there's four days until Christmas and um, I'm probably not gonna have this video posted until Christmas because I might be showing the gifts that I get and so obviously I don't want people to watch the video and then see what I'm getting them so probably post this on Christmas or like the day before not really sure maybe after even who knows it's a mystery to me oh yeah so I'm kind of in the middle of nowhere right now because I literally just drove out into the desert I have so many cups of coffee and like drinks in my car that I'm severely embarrassed to throw it out in a public trash can so I can't do that I just went out into the middle of nowhere so that nobody could see me throw them away <laughs> and now I'm driving back um, I'm not trying to spend too much money because y'all know how it is but I still want the presents to be nice so like some shmoney but not like shmoney shmoney but at the end of the day it's not about how much money you spend it's about the value of the mm, wait it's not the value no wait it's not the value of the gift it's the impact that it creates Hello? Hello? Okay, so please don't think I'm a bad mom. Or do. Whatever. Can you please give me your email address? I'm going to send you written link. Oh, okay. Um... So my mom just emailed me a like, Christmas um, wish list kind of things. Like she sends us each uh, like a little questionnaire thingy that like asks like what you're, you, you you're know, like what, what it's hard to explain. She sent me the ones that my siblings filled out so now I can go ahead and go um, have a better idea of what they want. I'm just gonna go straight to the mall and then if I can't get everything that I need at the mall then I'll go to um, other like department type stores. I know basically every time that I've driven here I complain about how confusing the roads are but literally coming from like Florida and now I'm here in like Phoenix the highway system listen like it's so there are exits like to the left to the right sometimes there's like an exit that turns into like two different exits and if you needed to take one of the exits that's off of like an exit of an exit and you miss the exit but I am in love with this HOV lane here. I don't know if this is like at every state or whatever. Like, because obviously I've only I've only had my license for like a year and a half. I'm gonna come up to my two-year um, license anniversary soon. But anyways, I've never seen an HOV lane before. And then here um, in Arizona. They have them pretty much on like every like um, city highway or whatever, you know, like that. Just like the ones that are here in Phoenix. And they have uh, time like parameters. They're only actual HOV lanes during like the morning. I think it's like 6 to 9 and then like 3 to 7. 
11, so like morning rush hour and then like nighttime, like evening rush hour. But outside of those hours, Honestly, I thought that one was for sure gonna break my camera. Um, I'm shocked that it's still working right now, but it's that holiday luck, you know? It's Christmas time, like, it's magical stuff. The camera's still working, and I'm alive. I've just spent like the last like 15 minutes like looking through um, the lists that I got sent. I don't really have too much to buy. I've just got like one thing to buy for my um, brother and then I have something to buy for my sister and then my sister-in-law I've already got a couple of things for her so we will see and this terrible little like bun thing I have going on right now literally a mess right now but that's okay it's all good it's okay I really feel like I'm gonna lose my car this mall is so big and like I don't really know where I am I think I'm behind the JC pennies um so this will be a fun little experiment to see how good I am at, at um, navigating myself back so yeah wish me luck hi so while I was in the mall they had a uh, one of those puppy stores and I literally am crying on the inside I really want to get a dog they were so cute like but I can't get one because I'm gonna like be working and going to school and stuff but moving on like past that back when I was driving I think it's recorded if it is I'm gonna insert the clip oh my gosh basically what happened was the rock a rock like flew up you know when you're driving like behind or like next to like a semi truck and like the wheels like spit rocks well that's what happened and it threw a rock right onto my windshield and now my windshield is cracked so I'm gonna have to replace that because it's really big and that's all literally from one rock so that's really nice if anybody wants to send me like $200 um, please let me know and pro feel, pff, 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 feel free you know let me know alrighty okay so I'm actually getting food um, cuz Taco Bell's right here and I literally love Taco Bell so we're gonna wrap gifts together so I hope you're ready for that This video has turned into a mukbang. Honestly, I kind of hated that. Last time that I went in there, they had it like, you could like walk up to the screen and like customize your order and everything like that. And then they make it, you know, like it sends it back to the kitchen. Um, but this time they had like a girl taking the order like through the, like for you, like at the screen. Like she asked what you want and then she would click it. That defeats the whole purpose of having what oh. Well, I'm gonna finish this and then I guess I'll see you guys later and we'll wrap. Mm-hmm. Well, thumbnail. Is this where we should do it? Oh my gosh. Please look up. Stop. Look at me, me. not the ground. Welcome back. It's much later now. Um and I made hot cocoa. And by hot cocoa, I mean coffee. 
and it's really it's not that great because it's what it's like I was too lazy to change the filter so I'm does anybody else do that like reuse the old it's like gas station coffee but we'll survive you know just a little bit not too much of um, some drugs Ugh. so but we can also do like a haul like obviously you're gonna see like the gifts as I'm wrapping them but so I got this for my sister-in-law so this is pretty cute so that will be one gift and then I got my brother similar one but he likes darker clothing and like blacks and stuff so I got him this version and it's a t-shirt instead of a sweatshirt from this place Tilly's which I've never heard of before is actually really nice like it's like a Paxson or like Hollister kind of a deal um and they have really nice clothing that's I mean pretty cheap honestly I thought would like be cute over like a top and like maybe some shorts or something like that during the summer or it could just go over like I don't know literally anything and then my brother's been needing new shoes so I got him a pair of shoes that he likes from bands then I got a whole bunch of like just more clothing like these are like joggers from JCPenney like headbands and stuff like that so just some random kind of stuff that I thought that everybody would like so I'm really sorry that you have to watch this but I like actually suck at wrapping Oh yeah, what's your guys' opinion on, like, wrapping clothes? Because I don't have any boxes or bags or anything to give gifts in. And I'm certainly not going to go buy bags just to put gifts in. So everybody's getting their gifts wrapped. Now because I'm truly chaotic, I'm going to put the shoes that I got my brother into this huge box. <laughs> um, this is comedy gold. Oh, well, perfect. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, it makes me feel pretty loosey-goosey. Thank you.